Hey everyone, and Happy New Year 2013? No, 2018. <laughs> so today I just wanted to share my sort of highlights of, two, of 2017 because I've done one of these videos, I think it was either last year or the year before, where I sort of spoke about my highlights of the year. So I thought I'd do it again. So if you want to check out that video and see what my highlights were, um, I will leave that linked over in the little icon thing that comes up. The, or um, down in the description, or both, who knows what will happen, but yes, I will leave that linked so you can check that out if you want to. So my first and biggest highlight of the year was right at the beginning of the year in January when I met my boyfriend, and so Ben, um, who, he hasn't appeared on my main channel just yet, there is plans for that to happen, I'm trying to convince him at the moment, <laughs> But uh, yeah, I met Ben back in January of 2017 and we have been together since, right up till now. So actually on this Wednesday coming up is our one year anniversary of being together, which is exciting. <laughs> then the second sort of highlight of the year, so I'm, I'm going to sort of do these in order of what they happened, it's the only way I can sort of focus them in my mind at the moment. So the second thing that happened in the year was in February of 2017 I was in a show so when I was at uni I was part of a group called Gilbert and Sullivan Society so Gilbert and Sullivan they're sort of just these two old guys uh, years ago who um, wrote these operettas uh, so sort of a comedy musical opera combination and so and um, the GNS Society they sort of um, put on a show one of their operettas every year so you rehearse and like learn the songs and then put on an actual production of the show in sort of the February of that academic year and so the one that we done in 2017 and it's also uploaded on YouTube if you want I can leave that link and you can check that out if you want but yeah so uh, the one we done this year or just gone was Pirates of Penzance um, so that is one of their more well-known shows. But no, it was just an awesome experience, a massive highlight of the year, and I just enjoyed every minute of it. You know, it's from the rehearsals with everyone to putting on the show, it was just a great experience, and I loved it. So the third highlight of 2017 was actually moving in with Ben. So where I am right now, this room, or this current flat, <laughs> is um so yeah i moved in with ben back in i think it was around about june july time um made it official we moved in together so yes that was exciting um i mean it still took me a while to get all my stuff in but we sort of made it as an official moving in back in june so yeah it's quite crazy yeah we decided to move in together it was a big step but one that we both pretty much saw eye to eye on so the fourth highlight of the year was um, getting my job at the cinema. So I worked at the cinema, this view cinema, I worked there four years ago before I went to uni. And yeah, I sort of left there when I went to uni. I could have moved, moved, moved on to, no, uh, I could have transferred, that's the word, when I went up to uni. But um, there was already quite a lot, you know, it was already a massive step going to university anyway. And so I didn't want to have working at cinema on top of that. So I didn't really transfer and kind of just left the cinema. But yeah, I got my job, well not at the same site, but anyway, I got the job at the cinema again back in, I think it was start of August sort of time. Been working there about six months, no, it's not six months, it's in August, September, October, November, December, five months. <laughs> so I've been working there five months now and um, yeah, it was just, great, you know, get on with everyone that's working there, because obviously it's none of the people that work in there were the ones that I worked with previously, four years ago, because it was a completely different, you know, location. But um, yeah, I'm getting along with everyone, it's great, made a whole bunch of new friends, and we have a lot of good fun. Of course we get on with our work and everything, but we still socialise at the same time, and it's really good. And also on top of just, you know, just general socialising. But they're quite um, accepting of me being trans as well, if you, if those who are watching don't know I am transgender, now to female. But uh, yeah, just everyone sort of, well, in fact, quite a few people didn't even know I was trans until I mentioned it. They just saw me as female. Um, they didn't, yeah, realise I was trans, so that's kind of a bonus as well. 
But no, um, when I have sort of spoken about it, everyone's been quite open and accepting, which is quite good. So that's also another highlight of the year. Then the next highlight, I've lost track of what number I'm on now, <laughs> but the next highlight of the year was back in November. I finally had my first GIC appointment. So if you want, I can do a whole separate video on the GIC appointment. I probably will anyway. So yeah, if I, when I eventually get to do that, I'll link it below or anything like that. Um, so yes, I finally had my first GIC appointment uh, back in November, um, which was overall very positive, I have to say. You know, I was quite anxious and nervous um, leading up to it because I wasn't quite sure, you know, um, how the appointment might go, what sort of questions they might ask me and that sort of thing. But um, it all went well, it was all positive, and I said I will do a video with more details on that in the future. Well, very near future, in the next sort of few weeks or so. And then the last sort of main highlight of the year was me and Ben having our first Christmas together, which was really good. Um, just, it was just, in general, it was nice and relaxing, to be honest, because I managed to um, book a few days of work and we went to um, Dagenham, where I'm from. We stayed with my parents for a few nights, and so we got to spend Christmas together, and it was just really nice, you know, getting to spend Christmas and relax and enjoy each other's company and share gifts and ex <laughs> just to experience the whole Christmas time together rather than being on my own. Well not on my own because in the past of course been with my family but I meant like actually being in a relationship for once is just a massive highlight and yes. So that's pretty much it from this video. If I wanted to sort of keep it direct and straight to the point otherwise I could ramble for a very long time <laughs> so i hope you like this video um maybe leave me if you want a comment of your highlights of the year or anything like that or if you want me to be if you want me to do a video or like in more detail or anything like i said i'm gonna do one on the gic appointment and anything like that um but if, if there is anything you want me to go into more detail with or if, if you just want to ask me a question in the comments i can respond pretty much but apart from that i think i'm going to end it here so I hope you like this video, if you do please give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to comment and subscribe if you haven't already and I shall see you next time. Bye bye! Mwah.